Hey everyone, today Miss Leela and I are going to take a trip around the Little River Gorge Road. We want to take you guys over there and uh, look around, see if there's any leaves left, go by the sinks, see what it looks like. I know it hasn't rained in a while, so the water levels are bound to be a little bit low. So we're going to go around and come out of Sugar Lands Visitor Center and see what we can find that's interesting to show you guys today. We're back in the park. Coming up to the Townsend We, Townsend Y. We're going to take a left towards Gatlinburg. Even though the leaves are on their way out, I expect that uh, there'll be a fair amount of traffic. It is Tuesday. Hopefully it won't be as much as the weekend would be. But nevertheless, there's always traffic in the Smoky Mountains National Park. So, everyone loves the park. It's always such a beautiful ride around through here. The little river just hugs the road and you just wind around the, the bottom. You, th you think you're almost in a cave, but uh, it's just so deep in the national park. That it's just gorgeous. There seems to be some water left, but uh, not a whole lot. Not what we're used to seeing, but uh, it's always dry in the fall. But, Looks like there could be some color left up in the tire peaks there, but uh, down here in the valley, not a lot Goodness. left. Coming up on the sinks here, so we're going to pull in here and see what we can see. Ms. Leila and I stopped here at the sinks. We see they've got this sign here about drownings that's happened and they'd be careful around the water. It's a very popular area, Miss Leila, to come swimming and to, there's a jump off spot, so. It's yes, it is. But wow, the water is down pretty low. We haven't had any much rain this fall and it's starting to take a toll on some of the streams. A little piece about the Little River Railroad. And we've got a video in our library about the Little River Railroad and how they come up here to mine or to cut wood rather to log and uh, wound up being a pretty good little tourist spot and you can see on here it's this is one of the areas that they stopped on their way up to Elkmont and to enjoy the water
you notice this spot here, it's kind of like a rock ledge. That water's pretty deep right there. That's where everybody likes to get over and jump off into the water. You have to be real careful, especially when it's down this far. But uh, here in November, I don't see many takers on the on jumping off. But in the summertime, it's not uncommon at all to see them lined up, ready to jump in that water and enjoy this beautiful place that we know as the sinks. It's a trailhead for the Meg's Mountain Trail, 3.5 miles, the Lumber Ridge Trail, 3.5 miles, and the Tremont Trailhead, 7.6 miles. Starts up there. Sphinx is a very popular area. We love it over here. Uh, the water's down, of course, because we haven't had any rain, but nevertheless, there's a lot of people here checking it out, and we just uh, really feel blessed to be able to come out and to enjoy this beautiful day. Nearly 80 degrees in November. Wow, it's hard to beat that. So uh, let's head on and see what else we can find. today. Coming up the mountain here, we're almost to the top. You can see the color is getting much more pronounced. So we're going to pull off over here to the side and take a look over on toward Gatlinburg and see see what we can see. There's a couple of different 
pull-offs down through here. And, man, every one just seems to be better than the last. So this is truly one of my favorites. So much color. The ridges literally look like they're on fire. It's just absolutely amazing here this late in the year to see this type of color. Friends, I'm here to tell you, this is truly America the Beautiful. Where else can you go to get a scene like this except the Great Smoky Mountains? Wow, we are truly blessed. Friends, if you're staying home thinking you missed the color, you haven't. There's plenty of color left to look at, even past peak. The beauty of the mountains is still here to behold. Wow, look at that mountain range, Miss Layla. Okay, we're coming back into Sugar Lands here. Off a of little river road. And it has been quite a trip. Much more colors than I was expecting, Miss Layla. Yes, I thought the leaves would be gone then, along with the color. A lot, even though a lot of them has fell off, there is more color left than I was expecting to see. Well, friends, that's going to do it today from the river road in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. The road that comes around from uh, Townsend, the Townsend Y, to Sugarlands Visitor Center. Man, we saw some color we wasn't expecting to see. What'd you think of that, Miss Leela? Oh, that's awesomely beautiful. It was amazing, wasn't it? Yeah. Even here in the first week of November, a lot of the leaves have fell off, as you noticed, but so many more on the trees and the color of the ridges and the mountain ranges were just absolutely amazing. So we hope you enjoyed this last little peak of fall as we fall into the winter months. But uh, hey, if you liked the vlog, Hit that big thumbs up button at the bottom and consider subscribing to Popular Adventures. 
We're going to be hitting Pigeon Forge and Gatlinburg, and we may even take a road trip here during Christmas and, and try to find some of the best lights and Christmas arrangements that we can for you guys because, hey, Christmas, we know the reason for the season, and we want to celebrate it. So until next time.